the public flats in Singapore may be getting smaller, but this has not lowered the standard of living, says HDB chief Cheong Kun Hien. Responding to concerns of shrinking flat sizes, Dr Cheong noted that living space per person has not been affected due to smaller families. Joanne Chan with more. Smaller bedrooms and tighter kitchen space. Compromises made as a result of smaller flat sizes. Figures from HDB's website showed that flats have shrunk by 5 to 10 percent in the last 20 to 30 years. Dr. Jong said the HDB tries to optimize the size of the flat. She noted that smart interior design can also help improve the living environment. Most of the global cities in the world, or big cities, people do pay attention to how they do the inside of the flat as well optimize the use of furniture, of storage, and it can be a very comfortable living environment. Dr. Cheong added that the living space per person has gone up as a result of smaller families. For instance, the average household size was 3.5 in 2010, down from 4.9 in 1980. This means an occupant in a 110 square meter five room flat today will have 31 square meters of space, while the resident in a 121 square meter five room flat in the 80s had only about 25 square meters of space. Speaking at a forum, Dr. Cheong said designing and building public housing is not an easy task. We really take care of people from the time they get married until they retire, all right? And this raises many expectations from our residents. First, we have to keep pace with changing and evolving needs and aspirations. So we need a greater variety of designs, yet keeping the cost affordable. So efficiency and cost are key for us to build value for money housing. Well-designed towns require fresh, bold ideas drawing inspiration from both the private and public sectors. For example, the HDB held a design competition for its Pongo waterfront project, receiving more than 100 entries. The eventual winner stood out for its unique design that maximised each resident's view of the waterway and for incorporating green features that tie in with HDB's push for sustainable living.